The violence generated by the gangs that plague the cities of the United States turns out to be a headache for the authorities. They are responsible for thousands of deaths of innocent civilians and other gang members each year. Citizens are demanding answers, and the police recognize that this is a problem they can no longer handle. In this video, we will name the 10 most dangerous gangs in the United States. 10. Somali Gangs Pandilleros who are recruited from the Somali community choose to become members of gangs like Crip or Blood upon arrival in the United States. According to FBI reports, since 2018 there has been an increase in all Somali gangs, creating tension with other gangs. These smaller groups engage in serious crime, including alien smuggling, human trafficking, prostitution, and bank card fraud. The Federal Bureau of Investigation detailed that the largest pockets of these gangs are in Minnesota, Washington, and Missouri, proving that gang violence is not just a problem in major cities. 9. The Aryan Brotherhood They were founded on a vision of white, racist hegemony, and the most notorious is the Aryan Brotherhood, also known as the Brand. It was wrought in California's San Quentin State Prison over 50 years ago by bikers of Irish origin. Although members of the Aryan Brotherhood represent only a small percentage of the country's prison population, they are responsible for up to 25% of all prison murders. This gang is involved in activities such as drug smuggling and prostitution, but especially hate crimes making them one of the most dangerous gangs in the United States of America. 8. California 18th Street Gang With over 15,000 members, the 18th Street Gang is the largest street gang in California. It has expanded rapidly in recent years. With members in 32 states, Los Angeles residents experience violent robberies on a daily basis by the 18th Street Gang. According to the Department of Justice, they have turned the Northern Triangle of Central America into one of the areas with the highest homicide rates in the world. They have been linked to murder, arson, assault, human trafficking, and prostitution, in addition to various other crimes. While they operate primarily in Southern California, they are also considered internationally active in Canada, Spain, the United Kingdom, Australia, France, and Mexico. The Aztecs The Aztecs originally started in El Paso, Texas, and many of their members were recruited from within the Texas prison system. Some of the gang's activity actually occurs inside Texas prisons. Los Aztecas' strict military structure and ties to major Mexican cartels help maintain order, and its members have been known to engage in drug trafficking, illegal alien smuggling, and murder. The gang is so well known that it even appeared in the video game saga Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. 6. Florence 13 The Florence 13 a South Los Angeles gang with ties to the Mexican Mafia are strong rivals to the 18th Street Gang. The Florence 13 are sophisticated drug dealers, known for committing murder and other violent crimes. In 2011, 94 Florence 13 gang members pleaded guilty to felony charges, but six members were sentenced by the court to life in prison for their violent crimes. 5. Latin Kings The Latin Kings, born on the streets of Chicago in the 1940s, are now the largest Hispanic gang in the United States. It's hard to know exactly, but there are an estimated 18,000 to 35,000 members in Chicago alone, and the group has reached 34 states. The strict organizational structure and strong religious aesthetic encourage loyalty, something the Kings take very seriously. 4. The Crips and the Bloods Technically, they are different bands. These two rival gangs are perhaps the best known in the country. 
The Bloods are a Los Angeles street gang that formed in the 1970s and quickly spread across the country. It is estimated that there are between 20,000 and 25,000 active members of the Bloods today. They can be recognized by their unusual hand signals and by wearing red outfits. The Crips were also founded in California in the 1960s before spreading across the U.S. Today, they have a strong presence in New York City. There are up to 50,000 active members of the Crips in the U.S. Both the Bloods and the Crips became embroiled in murder, organized crime and drug trafficking, and the bitter rivalry between the two gangs leads to frequent conflicts and violent retaliation between them. 3. The Royals formed in the city of Chicago in the 1950s and are the oldest and largest white gang in the United States. 53% of the members in Mississippi are white, even though all 97 people prosecuted for gang crimes in Mississippi between 2010 and 2017 were African American. According to City University of New York criminal law professor Babe Howell, police tend to underestimate the percentages of white, black, and Hispanic gang members. He explains that police view groups of white youth as individuals, each responsible for their own conduct, and view youth of color on the street as gangs criminally responsible for the conduct of their peers. 2. The Outlaws the outlaws make up the top 1% of the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the country, second only to the notorious Hells Angels. The outlaws are the biggest and toughest rivals of the aforementioned, and with over 1,700 members and hundreds of chapters, they are believed to be the largest outlaw motorcycle gang in the world. The outlaws, formed in 1935 at Matilda's Bar, located on Old Route 66 in a Chicago suburb, making them the oldest organization in the world. They are extremely active in the Great Lakes region and have been known to be involved in drug smuggling across the Canadian border. Violent confrontations with rival gangs are common. 1. The Mara Salvatruja, or MS-13 Born on the streets of Los Angeles, California in the 1970s, it has members in 42 U.S. states. The deportation of many members to El Salvador backfired on the authorities and facilitated the organization's expansion throughout Central America. MS-13 has no official leadership structure, but its loose organization doesn't stop it from being one of the most dangerous gangs in the country. With fewer than 10,000 members, they are so notoriously violent that the FBI has a separate special task force called MS-13 to try to combat them. Have you heard of any of these groups in the news? Leave your opinion in the comments.